Nice. So another Ice Climbers player for you Wait. guys. No. No? No, it's Cool Guy 69 versus Web. Oh, okay. Sorry, guys. We tricked you. Cool Guy 69 versus Web. Here we go. Uh, They're doing hand warmers right now. Yeah. I actually am... I, I don't know where either of them are from. I've played Web, if he is the Marth player. Uh, cool Guy 69 is from here. Cool Guy 69? Wait. Which one is he? Uh, cool Guy 69 is on the left. On the left? Yeah. Okay, so Web, um, I was playing in Friendly Season Marth player. He's pretty good. Yeah. Like, uh, we're going to... Oh, I'm trying to remember what he did. He did a lot of um, really intelligent forward smashes, mm -hmm. which is funny because I usually like, oh, if you're forward smashy as a Marth and you're forward smashing in neutral, yeah. um, I typically immediately label you as not very good. <laughs> and it was kind of frustrating nice. um, having it be so effective. So, All, right. All right, so here we go. It's going to be a game one on Yoshi's Story. Very interesting. You know, there's, there's a lot of uh, talk about... Uh, Who's better on this stage, Falco or Marth? Traditionally, it was Marth. But lately, because of like the combo game that Falco has in this matchup, mm -hmm. um, a lot think that it's better for Mar for Falco. Um, the platforms are actually really well spaced. He can shine off the top. Yeah. I say it's even. My personal opinion, I, I've said this for a while, I think this matchup, or this matchup on oh. this stage is even. And the tipper. So that's one thing that Marth definitely has going for him. Everyone knows this. Yeah. The tipper is universal on this stage. Yeah. You can tipper from a lot of places, and if you are on a platform, it could definitely uh, kill Falco at very low percent. Some excellent shines coming from Cool Guy 69. Oh, that roll in. That was that was a pretty obvious roll in. Yeah, Webb did not see it coming. I think he tried to pivot grab, and he accidentally did the uh, the dash grab. Out yeah. Of that turn around. Um, I I actually really like Webb's use of shield breaker as well. Ooh, oh, cool guy with that dare. That was a bad trade for Webb. Mm -hmm. Ends up losing a stock rather quickly. Two stocks apiece now. Now, here's the thing. It is even potentially, but if Falco doesn't use the platforms as much as Marth uses it, then he's just not using the advantage that he has. Yeah, very true. So oh, I, I wow. Love, I would love to see Cool Guy 69 um, get a little bit more damage when he gets those openings. Now, I really like the choice of uh, doing an up B right there. That was that was a really obvious position to use side B, uh -huh. and Webb saw it. And so he was going to do a forward smash on the side B, get a tipper, get the kill. Uh, cool guy 69 knowing this, ends up going with an up B instead. A classically worse option, but it doesn't matter if it's worse as long as the opponent doesn't know. Can I, can I call attention to the fact that um, Cool Guy 69 was charging an F Smash hoping that Webb would jump into it? And instead of jumping into it, he just charges his own F Smash on Randall for no reason. That was an, <laughs> that was an amazing answer. He's just like, you got F Smashes, dude? <laughs> oh, with the dare! <laughs> half Moon. That is the Half Moon. That's the Half Moon? Yeah, that's well, the Half Moon. He was looking very Moon esque in that one. Oh, that, yeah, that was very some, nice. That was some really, uh, really cool movement. Oh, wait, is he solving a Rupus Cube? Oh my gosh. He did not. Oh! Solve the disrespect. <laughs> He's just like, hey, uh, what do you been? One second. <laughs> <laughs> He's solving it during the match. Oh, uh, wh what's your ban? I'll tell you. I'm thinking. I bet he's only playing with one hand. Everyone, you can't really see, but uh, his left hand is only a controller. His right hand is solving a Rubik's Cube. Yeah, I'm just yeah. Kidding. You can see the Rubik's Cube. Yeah. All right. Okay, here we go. Game number two. He's trying to power shield. <laughs> the, there's that time. There's no times whenever, like, you're trying to power shield a laser, uh -huh. and one of them hits you, and so it messes up your timing, and so you try to power shield the second one, but your timing's now messed up, mm -hmm. and so you get hit by five lasers <laughs> before you decide, okay, Let's stop. <laughs> Not only that, um, hit, getting hit by a laser actually puts you in shield stun. So yeah. uh, just standing there and doing uh, here's a here's a word to the wise: just standing there trying to power shield is not going to work. Try dash dancing and power shielding when you turn. You'll have a much bigger frame or a frame window to power shield. Thanks to Ark for that knowledge. <laughs> Dang, um, Ark with the the primo knowledge. He should have made one of these uh, prima official strategy guides. Webb actually with a very brave dare right there. Um, cool guy was charging that th forward smash and oh, oh the tipper. Good up B. Yeah, cool guy definitely could 
die at a very low percent. Wow. And he oh, actually goes for taunted. the up air, followed by taunt. Uh, Webb could have gotten out of that that up air, but uh, there are times whenever you decide not to jump so you can hold on to it for your, you know, as a resource. But uh, right there, he really needed to jump, get out of that. Instead, he ends up giving a stock to that up air. A bear to taunt is my uh, favorite combo. Yeah. It's a true combo. Yep, very true. Oh, does it get up? He didn't actually have much <gasps> of an option there. <laughs> the reverse shield breaker and that the taunt. Sick. <laughs> that was sick. Both of these players. Everything combos into taunt. <laughs> dude, they're having fun. They're having a lot of fun. What do you think about that forward throw? Would you have done an up throw instead? Um, at that percent? No, forward throw is guaranteed. Okay. Now, at zero it is. Yeah. Um, if any more than that, he could actually buffer roll away if he has down and away. Mm -hmm. um, up throw, I definitely would have done after the initial forward throw. Uh, did he forward throw him twice or something? Yeah, he forward oh, throw yeah. twice. The, the, second, the second forward throw, I, would, I would definitely would have up thrown. Oh, good air dodge, but uh, cool guy 69 saw it coming. And wow, counters him with another taunt of his own. <sighs> The immediate response. Oh, He's just man. Like, I got taunts. I got forward smashes. Dude, these guys, they are going in deep. These taunts causing massive damage. So that down throw that um, Webb did is actually a, DI or a tech trap. Mm -hmm. um, unfortunately, he uh, DI'd close to him or DI'd basically in front of him when he down threw him. Um, so he was too far away. Mm -hmm. what, uh, what Webb should have done was wave dash a little bit to the right to make sure that his spacing was right and it wasn't true tech trap. Yeah. Because at the ledge, he can't tech in place. He can't tech um, towards the ledge because he'll just get forward smashed. Um, but if he techs in, it should be a re-grab. Yeah. All right. Forward smash now. Yep. Call that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, cool guy. Uh, it, it, he, he definitely wants to close out the stock. He's getting a little bit antsy with those forward yeah. smashes. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, sword dance. Dancing right. blade. Or, is that what that's called? You got the frame guide. I think it's, uh, it's, dancing, it's blade. dancing blade. Yeah. yeah. Sword dance is the Pokemon dude. <laughs> Oh, nice. Um, possibly should have gone with a back air there instead. Yeah. The up air doesn't really have that much knockback. It can be a kill move if they're, if they're high enough, but uh, back air would have put him at a better stage position in general. Oh, no. Oh, I can't believe they let him back on. Uh, Ledge yeah. back air would have uh, definitely sealed out that sock. As well as that, just uh, you really need to refresh your invulnerability. He had a lot of time to do it. Uh, oh, he's looking for a trade there. Yeah, unfortunately, Dolphin Slash has a pretty big hitbox coming up. Yeah. I actually don't know if it has invulnerability. It might. Dolphin Slash? Uh, yeah, coming up. Oh, uh, I, I can't remember. I think in the initial frames. Oh, gets him with his last taunt. This will be the last taunt of the day coming up. Yeah, if Webb closes the stock out, unfortunately, cool guy, yeah, 69th, will going. be Wait, taunting no Wait, he didn't no taunt. More. He didn't taunt. He, I think he was in the middle of an up tilt or something. I don't think he could have taunted. He was well. still uh, in the motion. Wow. Good games. Really fun. Yeah, they both looked like they were having a lot of fun with it. Yeah, yeah that was a lot of fun. Uh, so what were we talking about? I don't remember uh, moves like 